Hello and welcome to today's video. So today I'm going to be showing you how to create a really easy skeleton Halloween makeup look just using a few simple items that you may already have lying around in your makeup kit. So <laughs> this is the skeleton look that I'm going to be showing you how to create. So the first step to create this really easy skeleton Halloween makeup look is just to grab some black and white cream makeup. This one here came from Poundland and I will be using obviously both the black and the white shades. First of all I'm going to be taking the white cream makeup. So for this to start off with, just apply a thin layer of the white cream makeup all over the skin. It'd be much easier to get good coverage by doing a couple of thin layers so you can really build up the white. Once the first layer of the white cream makeup is applied, just go in and just apply a second layer once the first layer has dried just to build up a really good white base. Just go in now with your second layer of the white cream makeup. You should see that the white is obviously starting to build up a lot better now. <laughs> Now both layers of the white base makeup are down for your skeleton look. The next step is just to move on to creating the hollowed out eye effect. For that I'm going to be using a mixture of black eyeliner and black eyeshadow. You can obviously use any black eyeliner or black eyeshadow that you may have. So I have opted to use this black shade here from my Conspiracy palette. So taking a good sized fluffy brush, just pack loads of black eyeshadow onto the brush. You might want to just lift your model's head slightly back a bit so you can get all the way in there. And then just start by covering the eyebrows and obviously the eyelids as well. to get right into the corner of the eyes just to create that really hollowed out effect that you would expect from a skeleton. One little tip if you are experiencing quite a lot of fallout from the eyeshadow that you're using you could just alternatively just use a black eyeliner pencil for the whole thing or some black cream makeup just to prevent any fallout but I think personally it's a good start to use the eyeshadow because you get a I think a more convincing effect. So now that your first eye is done like this so this is just using the eyeshadow obviously just do exactly the same for the next eye. Once both eyes are done it will look something like this. If your model is super brave then you could put a eyeliner pencil just in the waterline but for the purposes of this we won't. So now both eyes are done I'm just going to be moving on to creating the nose part for this skeleton look. There's a couple of options you could use for this. You could use a eyeliner pencil just to draw out the shape and fill that in with either eyeliner or a black eyeshadow or alternatively you could take some black cream makeup to do exactly the same thing and I'm going to opt for the black cream makeup. So just taking this and I have got a flat makeup brush to apply the skeleton nose. 
So you just get your whole brush covered with that. And then you're almost doing like a teardrop shape on the end of the nose. It's going to be easier to trace your shape out first and then just fill that in with whichever method you've chosen, either the cream makeup or the eyeshadow or eyeliner. So there is the shape roughly traced out and I'm just going to fill that in with the same black cream makeup. So now the nose is all completed. The next step in creating this skeleton makeup look is going to be doing the teeth. So I'm taking the same black cream makeup and the same brush just to get that created. So I've just popped some of the black cream makeup onto my hand just for ease and taking that same brush again. You want to start at the outer corner of the mouth and just dab some lines all the way down to create the teeth. <laughs> Want to take this all the way from the top of the lip over the lip and then just underneath in one continuous line obviously all the way across the mouth just taking the same makeup and the same brush just paint over the lips you could obviously use a black lipstick or a black eyeliner if you didn't have this cream makeup now the teeth are done for the skeleton look, all that's left to do is just some shading on the cheekbones just to create like a hollowed out effect on the cheeks. For that I am going to be using the black eyeshadow again and just a angled makeup brush. So just taking your angled makeup brush and your black eyeshadow shade, just get a bit dabbed on, kind of less is more so you can build it up. And then you just want to apply that just quite gently onto the cheekbones. And then that's the effect that you should have there, just the cheekbones. There we go. And that is your completed skeleton makeup look. So there's just one last thing to complete this look and if you wish, you could put on an actual skeleton outfit, or of course you could elongate the makeup down onto the neck. So there is the completed look now with the skeleton outfit on. So I will give you a full view of the entire look and the outfit. so much for watching i hope that you are now feeling inspired as to how to create a really easy skeleton makeup look perfect for a halloween party or trick-or-treating but if you did enjoy this makeup tutorial please do give the video a big thumbs up leave me a comment and if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing and i'll see you again in my next video